guys welcome back to another video and if you're new here welcome in today's video i'm going to be making some ethereal fairy core nails i'm using these long nail tips from that i got from shein as always i'm going to show you how they look i really like them they're super long and they do feel sturdy i did already pick out my nail sizes and i did cut them down just a little bit so they can go with the design so if you guys want to see how it turns out please continue watching so as always i'm starting with the base colors for the nails i'm gonna be doing a good three maybe four coats of the colors depending on the shade tell me why this part literally took me forever because i was trying not to touch the clear part of the nail thinking that the chrome was gonna go on it but because i forgot that i actually wiped off the base coat that i've been trying to avoid touching it i did realize further along that i did <laughs> end up wiping off the base coat so i just went right in to finish it i don't know why this part took me so long For this nail, I'm going to be doing chrome isolation and I'm using the matte top coat and then after I cure it for a full 60 seconds, I'm going to wipe it off with some isopropyl alcohol.
silver bottle I am always using a base coat for the nails I know you guys can see the word base on the top of the yeah that but I just want you guys to know anyways <laughs> curing the layer of gel that I just laid down I'm just gonna add some caviar beads in there so they can sink down and just look nice and flushed and after I add the caviar bead I'm gonna go and put another little drop of gel on top of them so they can layer out evenly and then you're gonna see me turn it upside down so they can um, level out I'm not afraid. 
code to this nail because I will be doing some gold chrome. And you know, I ordered some gold polish so I didn't have to do this stuff, but it didn't come in time, so I had to end up doing this. colors together right there and then I'm going to put it in the openings of the butterfly wings. Whenever I know that I'm going to be using any type of hard gel 
I never charge my fast carrying lamp. Never. I just, and it always ends up dying on me. This one did too, which is why you guys won't see it anymore. I have to end up using the big lamp to cure the nail and then go back to the video. Like, I don't know why I always do that. going to be doing the pinky nail i did avoid doing it on purpose because i wanted to get all the easy designs out of the way first so i'm just going to be doing some flower petals on the nail wake up. For these petals i'm honestly i'm not doing it perfect i want it to look as messy as possible just so we can just give that wavy petal vibe so yeah i'm making it as messy as possible i don't want it to be too perfect Wake up, wake 
more out of focus but i'm just adding the gold chrome on the sides of the stem and some of it got on the top but that's okay because i'm just gonna add color on top of it anyways <music> when I was adding these little straw thingies I should have literally done them one by one and then cured it because they were all over the place that was my one mistake I should have done one at a time and cured them so yeah a learning lesson from now on if I ever decide to use these again did get cut short because the storage on my phone was full and I had to handle that and right now I'm just filling in the empty spaces with the mixed foil that I mixed earlier on in the video so yeah I'm just gonna be filling those in so guys this is a mirror sheet and you are able to cut it I got it from Amazon so I will have the link down below along with any other product that I use in this video this mirror charm um idea from a tiktoker her name is Susie. i will have her information on the screen so you guys can check her out she did this really cute nail set and she added this little mirror and i thought it would look so good with this set so all credits to her are gonna know this but i switched the clip this one in particular right here um i did do the other nails already but i wanted to go back because i forgot to add these little rhinestones and because i wanted to keep all like the clips together instead of having them spread out all over the place that's why you see the other designs for the other nails <music>
girlies this is the final look they came out so perfect i love them so much it's definitely giving fairy core vibes at real like i'm just in a fairy world right now but they definitely took me on a joy ride because i did not know what i was gonna do for each nail and i'm so glad that everything came out so well and it just all looks good together um, let me know what you guys think about this set in the comments. Do you like them? Would you wear this set? And yeah, let me know. And if you are new here, welcome. I do hope you stick around and consider subscribing to my channel. You will love it here. So yeah, as always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.